Rio de Janeiro has been making headlines with violent demonstrations against recent increases in bus fares and World Cup spending that many Brazilians consider excessive. But social unrest doesn't seem to be spoiling the city's determination to party. Rio's world-renowned carnival runs from February 28th to March 4th. The neighborhood samba parties are already starting to warm up. CCTV's Lucretia Franco reports. The contagious rhythm of samba fills the air. It's carnival season in Rio de Janeiro. From now until March, revelers will take the streets to dance and party every single weekend. Samba players perform on top of soundtracks and draw crowds to the blocos, as these neighborhood street parades are called. There will be some 500 events like this across the city, starting ahead of the official carnival holiday. For the tourism industry, it is the moment to show the best of Rio. It is a great opportunity to get to know Rio. We are expecting 900,000 tourists for Carnival and 6 million with the World Cup this year. Street parties are a big part of this city's Carnival celebrations. They are free. Everyone, including locals and foreigners, are welcome to samba dance with costumes of all sorts. Many tourists are already in town. It's very lively, people are dancing, and uh, yes, it's a pleasure to look at them. This is one of the most anticipated times of the year for real citizens. They flood the streets of dozens of neighborhoods with just one idea in mind, to forget everyday problems and just have fun, do what they want, even if it's just for this moment. Despite widespread social unrest in Brazil against the government's lavish spending on the World Cup, no one is complaining about spending on Rio's carnival. So far, the show goes on, and nothing seems to be spoiling Rio's carnival. Lucrecia Franco, CCTV, Rio de Janeiro.